Hi, everyone, and welcome to the big house. This massive crowd assembled here today to cheer on the Wolverines, already chanting, Go Blue. Today, it's a top 25 matchup. Two teams off to good starts, hoping to build on that and test themselves against another ranked team. As we'll see the number 11 team in the country, the Oklahoma Sooners, taking on the number one team in the land, the Michigan Wolverines. 3A Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler, here in the booth with Kirk Herbstreit. I think we've talked long enough, Kirk. Let's get this game going. Big guys up front, lined up, it's first down. Cut quickly. He'll go down there after picking up a few yards. Not going to be enough for the first. Second down play coming up for this offense. That's going to be incomplete. A lot of contact. No flag. Brings up third down. Quick throw. That's an RPO caught on the left side. That is a huge play. Finally brought down at the 46-yard line. And the Wolverines will line up on first and ten. Finds a receiver in the middle of the field. That's a nice completion here by this Michigan offense. And when Michigan is really clicking, you think about over the years, they've been efficient within that passing game. Being able to throw the football to complement a very physical running game. Nice play. An exciting spin move, but doesn't produce much of a game. For the defense coordinator this week, And the Michigan offense back out on the field. They reached the end zone the last time out, trying to do the same thing here. Using his legs, it's Hall. They bring him down to the 32-yard line. Just love watching his back run. Gets behind that offensive line, lowers his pads, and gets a nice, solid game. Second down after that run on the previous play. And now the running back's got it again. They'll stop him behind the line for a loss of one. Chris, that play just didn't have much of a chance at all from the snap. The quarterback hands this off, and there's just nowhere to go. It's almost like the defense was anticipating the play call, and they put themselves in a position to come up with a nice tackle for a loss. It's a screen pass complete to the running back. That's a big game before he goes out of bounds. It'll move the sticks more than enough for a first down. Boy, this is great execution. And the Wolverines offense is back on the field. A fumble the last possession only led to a field goal. Can they shake off that mistake and get it going here? They start the drive with a quick throw to the left side. They bring him down, but that's a good play. Moves the ball to the 39. Nicely run slam here. Fresh set of downs for the offense. First down. Out left, complete. Finally brought down, but the offense moving close to the red zone here. The defense is spread all over the field, creating some one-on-one -on -one matchups, and the quarterback makes them pay for it. Here's a first and ten play. Here's the snap. Quarterback drops back. Caught on the outside. It's Hall. And he runs out of bounds there to avoid the contact and take the loss. And one final play before the end of the quarter. Testing the right side here. The defense able to bring him down to wrap up the first period of play. So far, this has been a battle on the ground. They've completed the first quarter, and the run game has dominated. for the second period. Here we go. First play of the quarter. Offense setting up for a second down play. And the ball caroms into the receiver's hands. 
It's a big gain all the way to enemy territory, tackled at the 45. The offense really clicking against this battle defense. And it's complete downfield. An explosive play moves the ball all the way down near the 25-yard line. But Chris, with this style... Here's the second down play. And the pass is intercepted. A takeaway for the defense. And he'll be taken down, but after a good return. He didn't really seem to feel like he had anybody open. He just puts it up in the air, and the defense says, thank you, we'll take it. And the Michigan offense comes back out on the field. They had some good things going on the last drive, but it ended suddenly with the pick. Let's see what they can do here. You know, in the RPO game, the quarterback's got to make really sound decisions on that read. So it's third and long from the 29. The defense play coverage or blitz. Dropping back, they're going to throw for the first down. Looking for the wideout. A bullet, but it's incomplete. Brings up and fourth down. Well, Chris, obviously, they had to go through the air. Great spot to start this drive for the offense. They're going to run it here. They stop him after a six-yard gain. So second and four. Chris, it's the consistency of this back is... Okay. Offense needing to keep this drive alive. It's a third down play. Can he get there on the ground? And he will be stuffed for no gain. Just not a lot of room there on the RPO on third down for the offense. Give the defense... First down here, the offense has time for one more play before the two-minute warning. And the clock stops now for the two-minute warning, a chance to strategize here before we reach halftime. Off the play fake on first down. Running out of time in the pocket. And the sophomores got him for a sack. I like to call him here, but you can't run long, developing play-action passes like that if the offensive line is not going to give the quarterback time to throw. Receiver makes the grab. Anytime a quarterback and a receiver are in sync, you've got a chance to make a very successful play. Great job here by the offense. Looks downfield and connects with a wide open wide receiver. Touchdown, Wolverines. Just ran away from the defense. This guy can do it all. We've seen him go behind coverage and make plays downfield. We can see him catch the ball underneath, just like this. And when he catches a football, he is so dangerous after the catch. This one leads him into the end zone for the six points. Hey, Offense getting set. It's second down. Here's the snap, looking to throw. And he dumps it off to the tight end. And a big game before he goes out of bounds. The offense keeps churning, gets a fresh set of downs. The tight end drag route is the perfect... And the Michigan offense back out on the field. They got into plus territory last time, but the drive ended on a fumble. They got to shake that off immediately. Now begin with a quick throw to the left. Receiver brought down after a short pitch and catch. Important second down play coming up. And they wrap him up after the completion just short of the first down marker. That run sets up an important third down call for this offense. Quick throw with the quarterback off the RPO. 
And they keep the drive going. It's a first out of the 46. Man, you just continue to see the chemistry between these two. And they told us yesterday in our production meeting, they spent hours and hours of working and developing that chemistry and that rhythm by throwing together throughout those summer months. And man, it's starting to really oh, pay oh, off. Oh, He's oh, become oh, oh, his security blanket for the quarterback. And especially on third down, get him the ball. And the head coach will decide to accept the penalty and take the yard. Second down after that previous play. Quarterback drops back. And oh, he almost had it. A chance for a momentum-changing interception. It does bring up third down. We'll see if the offense can move the chains off that incompletion. Runs through the defender. Defense able to stop it. It's fourth down now. Well, I would just stick with this RPO. That's a really... First down play call coming up. How aggressive will it be? We'll try the ground game here with the running back. And the senior able to make the stop after a short game. Christina, the spread era over the years has always grown offensively. I've been always impressed with defenses that really build their defense to play in space still have an ability to be sound at the line of scrimmage and defend a running game. It's exactly what we saw right there. Offense getting set up. Here's second down. They snap it. Quarterback looking to throw the ball. He's a wide open receiver complete. They finally bring him down, but he makes it inside the 15 yard line. First down, a great scoring position. So the offense calls a timeout here, but it's their first of the half. Timeout. All right, so it's first and ten back inside the five-yard line. We're going to see how much this play caller trusts his quarterback. How aggressive will he be from this spot? Deep ball is caught for a huge gain here. Oh, and he's in the clear now. It's a foot race. Takes it all the way to the house. Touchdown, Michigan. I can't believe they threw the football. I think the defense is surprised as well. Looked like they had everybody up near the line of scrimmage to just stop the run because they thought they might take the easy way out. Instead, they show confidence in the quarterback. They throw the football, and my gosh, does it pay off. 99 yards for a touchdown. So that's now back-to-back -back wins, Kirk, over quality opponents. This team really building some momentum. I agree. I, I think there's a lot to build on with this team and what they've been able to do these last few games. We'll just have to see how far this streak can extend and how much this team can keep improving. And that is going to wrap it up. We enjoyed this one here. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Chris Fowler, and this has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football.